Uh, we just wanted to win. You know what I mean? We, we wanted to set a tone uh, in and every night, and we sort of did that. Tonight. 17 assists since you're with the Rockets. You know I play a little bit. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, um, uh, good, good win for us. We just, you know, more, more than anything, you know, our defense was pretty good. Obviously, they went on runs, which they always going to do. But as I said in my post-game interview, playing hard isn't enough against them. You, you got to play smart. You got to play smart for 48 minutes because they're not going to beat themselves. You talk about Kenneth Green's performance, man. He was all over the place, yeah. active, on the glass, hitting threes even. Yeah. Talk about what he's brought to the table. Kenneth for works on those threes day in and day out. You know what I mean? I think the way we play, we just play with trust. You know what I mean? You know, this guy. You know, give it to him, see if he make the right play. And, you know, we talked about his arguments, stuff like that. But, you know, as long as you get past it and get through it, uh, you know, we just keep building. DeMarcus Cousins has been playing real well for these guys. But you, you guys had a lot of success against him. But what was what was the key to that? Um, I don't know. Um, you know, they got a lot of different lineups they throw at you. You know, ball screen is, you know, our bread and butter. You know, I done made a career on ball screen. so. You try to put different guys in it and make plays. How much depth do you guys have, knowing you guys don't have James, but that you have yourself, guys like Kenneth? I mean, the depth that you guys have on your team to be able to. Yeah, it's, it's good and well, but we just got to keep putting it together. You know, they, the guys came here and won without me, and then we won without James. But we'd be fooling ourselves if we was to say, you know, we could win it all without him. You know what I mean? So for us, it's about continuing to build. Uh, we still got to get Shump back, and just just keep hooping. Chris, what do you make out of the fact you guys are free, you know, against them? Like you said, you've won without you. You've won without James. Uh, TV was moving. Say that one more time. You guys are 3-0 against them. You've won without you. You've won without James. What, what do you make of your success Nothing. against them? Nothing. Yeah. Like I said, man, I watch games and stuff too much. You know, you can come in here and win on a Monday night in February or, you know, Tuesday night in November or December. But in the playoffs, it's when you got to beat a team four out of seven times. So. You know, it's great we won tonight, but two days, y'all forget this. You know, we all will. <laughs> what, what does it feel to break this barrier of 9,000 9, 9, assists in your career? This is a generation of point guards that sometimes forget to, to pass the ball. They want to score a lot. That happened <laughs> when? Tonight. 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 You broke it. Um, oh, man, it's, it's an honor and a privilege. And let me watch what I say because I think people – misconstrued what I said last time about John Stockton or something like that. And uh, John Stockton, his record will never be broken because he was so durable. You know what I mean? He played night in and night out. And uh, it's, it's great to break 9,000 assists. Um, also just means I'm getting a little older. I've been playing for a while now. But um, it's, it's, it's always cool. And I always say, when you get assists, you know, I got the easy part. I just pass it. You know, the other guys are the ones that got to make the shot. So. But, you, but you, you, you build excitement in the crowd when you do it in a beautiful way, you know, playing the, the, the game as it used to be in the past sometimes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, try to. You know what I mean? Like, it's, 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 it's a team game. You know what I mean? And you need guys. Uh, and just getting guys involved is fun. Like, for me, I'm not a guy who plays above the rim. You know what I mean? I probably could if I wanted to. But uh, you know, for, for me, being a guy that doesn't dunk and things like that, I get a kick out of seeing guys, you know, finish and score.